happening? Why are you yelling? What have I done? I want you to go do the dishes right now. Mom, I'll do them later. Can I just- Are you giving me disrespect? What the- No! How was that? I don't even want to argue. You're gonna get the belt right now. Whoa, 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 chill. I'm sorry, okay? Trust me, Simon. This hurts me more than it hurts you. Oh, seriously- Wait, what? You heard me. I said this is gonna hurt- Oh, I heard you. Um- how does that work? Excuse me? How is this gonna hurt you if you're the one with the belt? Because if I hit you, I'm gonna feel pain on the inside. And if you hit me, I'm gonna feel pain on the outside. Believe me, Simon, this is for your own good. No, it's not. You think I wanna hit my son? I'm gonna say yes, cause you wanna hit me over the dishes. You know what? I'm getting your father. Honey, I gotta start listening to the voices in my head. What do you want? Our son is being disrespectful. She's saying that hitting me with the belt is gonna hurt her more than me. Yeah, that's definitely not true. What? Yeah, I mean, you're literally choosing to hit him. I don't understand how this is gonna hurt you. You know what? You do it. I'm not dealing with this anymore. Dang it. Okay, class, let's begin today's lesson. So, when we did this last time... We were learning about taking our work and then doing- Oh my god! Yo, oh my god! Oh my god, oh my god. god. dude, it's him! Yo, how did he get out of jail? Out. He's out of jail, what the- No, bro. isn't Kyle supposed to be in jail? No, he just got parole yesterday. Oh my god, I hope he doesn't sit next to me. Yo, Simon. You mind if I sit here, bro? Uh, <laughs> no, of course not. I don't mind. Yeah, you better not. What are you punks looking at? Kyle, right, if we're gonna talk to students like that, I'm gonna have to send you to the principal, okay? Yo, what'd you say, bro? I'm gonna keep my mouth shut. Did he just threaten the teacher? Menace, what, what are we gonna do? Guys, I've got this. The best way to handle a bully is to be friends with him. What is this, family guy? Don't worry, I'll talk to him. You're gonna die. Yeah, so I was arrested for assaulting an elected official and- Yo, what's up, Kyle, my bro? No one talks like that. But bro, why are you talking to me? I was thinking I could be your homie since you don't really have any right now. Yo, excuse me? Whoa, Relax, it's not my fault you don't have any friends. He's got me. We're We're gonna die, bro. Let him go, bro. Let him go. Relax, bro. Chill. He's gonna die, bro. This guy's insane. Oh my god. Oh. Yo, son, I have a riddle for you. Okay, if I get it right, you owe me a hundred dollars. What? No, that's too much. Well, I don't want to do it then. Okay, fine. You're not gonna get it anyways. Now? I'm really mad. What is a three-letter word that starts with gas? Yeah, ma, uh... What? Gas is already a three-letter word. I know. What's another three-letter word that starts with gas? You have one chance. That's not fair. Um... Air? Eh, wrong. What? Then what's the answer? Car. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Wow, I think air is way better. Where's my money? No, you lost. Then tell me how you're gonna start a Tesla with gas. Oh. Ha <laughs> ha! What? What's wrong with you? I got in trouble today in class. Oh, Lord. But it wasn't my fault. What happened? So we were taking a test, right? The one you studied for? Yeah. Okay. And I caught this one girl looking on my paper. Wow. So I told her to stop. Did she stop? No, she kept doing it. And what did you do? I broke my pencil in half and stabbed her with it. Anaya! What? It was with the eraser. Oh my goodness, what happened next? The teacher started yelling at me and accused me of cheating. Did you tell her that you weren't cheating? Yeah, but she said I was guilty by association. Oh, uh-uh. So she sent me to the principal's office. But you didn't do anything wrong this time. I and now I have to get a hundred on this assignment or I'm getting suspended. Let me see the assignment. Here. Mm-mm. Where you going? To cuss your teacher out. Okay. Few moments later. <laughs> Hey, Mrs. Ickes, 
Um, I'm just calling to speak with you about your uh, son's behavior today. What did you do this time? Well, for show and tell today, your son thought it was a good idea to bring in a missing child poster and call the number on it in front of the whole class. And when the mother of the missing kid picked up, he whispered into the phone, Mommy, I miss you. And then hung up. Huh? What are you talking about? I never did that. Shut up, you delinquent. Anyway, that's not even the worst of it. Last week, we had a field trip to go to the hospital. You know, we were dissecting things and looking at all the nurses' stuff. And your son asked to go to the bathroom. But instead of going to the bathroom, he went to the nursery. And he switched around all the babies. And he didn't tell us until this week. So those babies already went home with the wrong mothers. Thank you. That, that, that's all I need to hear. I'll take care of it when he gets home. Three hours later. No. When you miss the school bus. Oh no. Cruising on that main street. You're relaxed and feeling good. Next Hey mom. Yes. I missed the bus. You what? It came early today. This is the third time this week. I know, but go wait in the car. Okay. Great, now I'm gonna be late to work. Few moments later. Find out they see me rolling, find out they hate to watch all in the crowd and get you riding dirty. Wait. What is it now? I forgot my backpack. That's it. You're walking to school when we get back. But that's like 20 miles. I don't care. That's what you get. Three hours later. I finally made it. Yeah, school's over today. Everyone have a good rest of your day. You've got to be kidding me. Oh. Anaya, can you shut up? What did I do? Thawie, I'm just in my feelings. What's wrong with you? Mom won't let me go on the field trip. Oh, man, that sucks. Where were y'all going? To the wax museum. Yeah, you can't go. Why not? Last time we went, you knocked over one of the wax figures and peed on it. He was looking at me funny. He was a clown. Mm. Why are you bringing up old stuff? We had to pay. We? Mom had to pay $50 in damages. 50 Wow. How will we survive? The point is, you really shouldn't go. Okay. 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 So you're not gonna try to convince me? Nope. Uh, um. I'm a new person, Taiwa. I listen to grown-ups. You're gonna steal somebody's ticket, aren't you? Yep. And remove their tongue if they say something. And I Shut up! Listen, babe. I gotta tell you something. Okay? Why? I know you gonna get mad, but listen, bro. I messed up. Messed up? How? How did you mess up? So today, I cheated on you for the 13th time. <gasps> but listen. No, why? listen, listen. I know, babe, but listen. Babe, why? I promise it won't happen again for the next two or three days. I promise you, babe. Promise. Okay? Okay, babe. I love you. I love you too, babe. We good? Yeah, we're good, but I have to tell you something too, babe. What? What you gotta tell me? So, I messed up today too. What you mean you messed up? What you did? So, today at work, uh huh, I let a guy hold the door open for me. No, no, but babe, listen, listen, babe, babe. Listen, it was only one time. I, I promise it will never happen again. Please. What you doing to me? Oh, I trusted you. Sorry. Oh. I'm sorry. It's over. Babe, it's I, over with. I, I, no, sorry. no, no, it's over with. I can't even look at you. Yo, bro, why were you at school yesterday? You missed it all. Bro, fuck school. Like, I, I I was skipping, but what I missed? Dog, we had an assembly. Mr. Beast was the guest speaker. He gave everyone 15 bands. 15,000. Nice. 
Then put that on your mom. On my mama. That ain't even the best part, bro. You know, Jaquarius? Bro fought Mrs. Garcia. He pulled a 1-2 Chris Breezy, knocked her clean out. Then he did the race, bro. They still have not found him. That's weird. Why didn't you text me to pull up, bro? I would've came. Like, I want to see Mrs. Garcia get knocked out. I hate that. Bro, I thought she was sick or something, so I didn't even say anything. But nah, bro, eighth period, you don't understand. One of the special ed kids got a hold of a lighter, started running around the school lighting everything on fire. Bro committed arson. No. And then in the, the fire department had to come. They were putting out all the fires and stuff. And in the heat of that, Ash Cash and Madison Beer pulled up. And they was asking where you were, but I was like, I think he's sick. Like, I didn't know. And they, they were like, oh, all oh, that sucks. What? Guys, guys, what are we going to do? Did you hear the news? They might shut down TikTok. Calm down, Billy. I doubt it's going to get shut down. Yeah, and even if it does, that's what we got a YouTube for. Oh, yeah, but wait. We have 8.7 million followers on TikTok, and on YouTube, we have like 1.1 million almost. So that means that 7.6 million of our followers don't follow us on YouTube! Hey everybody, Grandma's here. What's all the commotion about? I could hear you all the way in the driveway. Hi, Grandma. And that's just Bill you hear screaming. He's nervous that TikTok's gonna get shut down next month. Of course I'm nervous! Why is nobody else nervous? Grandma, 7.5 million of our followers don't follow our YouTube! Oh, well that's not a problem, Billy. We're gaining subscribers pretty fast. That's why I'm throwing a sandal at your head for every new subscriber. Ouch! Oh man, I forgot about that! Oh, would you look at that? Looks like we got another subscriber. You know what that means, Billy. Ouch! Knock it off, Grandma! Well, do you want to gain subscribers or not, Billy? Oh, man! I guess you're right! Go ahead, Grandma! Hey, Grandma! It looks like we just gained another subscriber! Oh, really? That's awesome! You know what that means! Ah! Go subscribe! This is awesome. I hope we go up like 5 million subscribers. Are you subscribed? Where's the birthday girl? Mom, what are you doing here? What do you mean, what am I doing here? It's my grandbaby's birthday. You think I'm not gonna be here? Well, I didn't invite you. Oh, I don't care. I don't need an invitation to come see my family. Okay, well, you're here now, aren't you? Where is she? Come give grandma a big hug. Uh, well, actually she's in the balance house with her friends right now. Well, go tell her grandma's here. You know, I, I asked you not to just show up here. Oh, it's fine. No, you see, you remember last time it just, it, I, I'd rather you just call before you come over. But, 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 but you don't get to tell me that I can't see my granddaughter. And I'm not saying that. I'm just saying that we have very specific boundaries that we put in place. I don't want to hear it. It doesn't apply to me. But yes, it does. It specifically applies to you. They are set in place because of you. Oh, there's the birthday girl. Come give grandma a hug. Sweetheart. C come give grandma a hug. Why don't you go ask for a high five? Oh, well, no, I want a hug. Come give grandma a hug. Come on, come on. You suck. Mom, she isn't comfortable with that. Well, because you're telling her that. No, she just doesn't like hugs, so we use high fives as a replacement. Oh, is that right? Is mom telling you that you don't get to love grandma? Okay, all right. Well, I guess you don't get to keep this birthday present then. Mom, you're yelling at a nine-year-old who's expressing their boundaries to you, so now you're not only disrespecting my boundaries, but my child's. Well... This place is disgusting. When I walked in here, it smelled like someone had vomited in a, in a coffee pot, so. Okay, thanks. Now, I don't know what I did as a mother to make you treat me so badly, but you are a stuck-up brat. Oh, well, can I introduce you to who I learned that from? You. <laughs> Officer, my wife is missing. She went out yesterday, and she never came home. Okay, stay calm, sir. What's her height? <sighs> um... Maybe like 5'5", five, five, no, 5'7", five, 5'6", five, I'm not too sure. She's shorter than me. Okay, what's her weight? I have no clue. Um, She's not really slim, but she's not really big. What about her eye color? I think they're green. Wait, no, brown. Actually, I don't know. I, re I never really looked that close. What color's her hair? Uh, I'm not too sure. She just went to a new hairdresser, so it changed. Okay, what was she wearing when you last saw her? She was wearing a blue dress. Or were those jeans? 
Or maybe she was wearing shorts. I don't know. <sighs> Did she take a vehicle when she left? Yes, she took my vehicle. And would you happen to know the brand? Yes, it's a 2022 Black Sport Appearance Ford F-150 Lariat 5 liter V8 engine with 400 horsepower and 400 torque stock. But I installed a 3 liter Whipple supercharger, so now it has 775 horsepower and 685 torque. It has the max trailer tow package, so it has a big 136 liter gas tank, black leather seats, power deployable running boards, twin moonroof, FX4 off-road package with skid plates, Bang & Olufsen Unleashed 18 speakers sound system, 360 cameras, blue cruise so it could drive itself, power tailgate, 2000 watt generator built in the bed, 3.73 electric lock rear axle, upgrade all terrain tires, 20 inch 5 spoke, dark alloy wheels, and it also has a Borla Attack exhaust with black chrome tips, and unfortunately one of them has a dent in it from a rock. Don't worry sir, we'll find your vehicle. <laughs> Thank you. It's happening right now. I'm watching it on TV. It's on TNT. Everything you see on TV isn't real. For real? Yes. So Tom Hanks isn't being held hostage by Somali pirates? No. Oh, thank God. You're serious. Does Uncle Jesse and Uncle Joey really help Danny Tanner raise his three daughters? No, Darren. What about when Michael Jordan was playing the Looney Tunes in that game of basketball? Not real. Well, they fooled me. I'm not surprised. Is Will Smith really a prince? No. The now? I'm really mad! Does everybody love Raymond? No. Are Chandler and Joey really friends? Maybe. I don't know. Tell me this. Is Danny Zuko really a member of the T-Birds? It's a movie. Darren. Did Jack and Rose really make the Titanic? They're acting. I cried during that scene. Of course. Leonardo DiCaprio is dead though, right? He's alive. He's alive? He's alive. He's alive. Leonardo DiCaprio. Yeah, well, apparently they're acting. Unbelievable. Is Rambo real? No. Bring it on? No. So Kirsten Dunst didn't seal Gabrielle Union's chair? No. I gotta go. Spider-Man's real though, right? No, Darren. Emotional damage! What? Oh my god, is that Dylan? Yeah, that is him. Jesus, I haven't seen him since his girlfriend died. Dude, he's coming to us. All right, just act like it's normal. Don't focus on it too much. What's up, guys? Long time no see. Yeah, how you been? Um, I'm, I'm okay, you know, been better. Hey, I'm really sorry about Claire, man. Thank you. I'm sure if she was still here, she'd love to see you guys. Yeah, I bet. I'm just glad you were able to come out, dude. Proud of you. Yeah, I was just thinking, you know, she wouldn't want to see me crying inside all day. She'd want me to go out and live my life. And that's what you're doing! Celebrating the big game with your boys! That's right. Let's treat this like a party in the good old days. Okay, who you got winning? That's tough. It's close. Now, I think the Eagles got the better defense, but... Mahomes is too good. Nah, I think it's gonna come down to the run game, and the Eagles got the edge there. Claire's favorite bird was the eagle. Okay. Sorry, it just popped in my head. Nah, you're good. What uh, what, what about the halftime show? Oh my god, Rihanna? I love Rihanna. What's your favorite song? It has to be Diamonds, between that or Love on the Brain. What? No, everybody knows Umbrella's her best song. No, it's not. You're just being a bandwagon. Bandwagon? Umbrella was Claire's ringtone. <laughs> I just want to hear her voice one more time. Dude, if you want to sit down, we got a bunch of snacks. Yeah, I made a whole feast. We got buffalo wings, pigs in a blanket, tri-tip sliders. I'm vegetarian. Oh yeah, Claire was the one who made me stop eating meat. So, by staying vegetarian, in a way I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm continuing her impact on me. Yo, dude, if you want, you can get out of here. I can call you an Uber. Claire died from an Uber driver. Why would you mention Uber? <laughs> Slipped my mind, I forgot, okay? Well, say something. What do I say? Anything, I don't know, he's crying. Hey, maybe Claire wasn't the best girlfriend. What? Why would you say that? Yeah, why would you say that? Because she was cheating on you. With who? With me. <laughs> he needs some milk! Oh my god, I just got drafted into the NBA! Uh, with the first overall pick, I get a $25 million signing bonus. Wow, honey, that, that's amazing! We can move! We, let's go move into a mansion! Yeah, what, 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 what she said, let's, let's all just, let's all go move into a mansion! Dad? Where have you been? It's been 18 years, and you went out looking for the milk. Why did you come back with with oat milk? You had 18 years to to pick out the best possible milk, and you got oat milk. See, almond milk would 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 have been fine, but oat milk? What what are you doing? Uh, I, I I was I was doing research for those 18 years, trying to find out what the best milk was. Turns out it's this baby right here, uh, oat milk, and I'll sell it to you for a uh, million dollars.
Tommy, how many times do I have to tell you? After you're done using a cup, put it in the dishwasher. You're grounded for a month. Get up to your room. But I wasn't done using it. I was going to get a drink later. Oh, what are you, a little smart aleck? Make that two months. Oh, man. Fine, whatever. What? Don't be disrespectful to your mother. You know what? You're grounded for the next year. Get up to your room. Are you serious? But I didn't even do anything. Oh, so now you're back talking to me? You know what? Go up to your room and don't come out until you're 18. Fine, whatever. Billy, sweetie, dinner's ready. <gasps> Billy, what are you doing? Were you playing ball in the house again? I told you, no more playing ball in the house. Yeah, I'm sorry, Mom. And then I accidentally kicked the ball too hard. And I broke your lamp. See, this is why I told you we don't play ball in the house, Billy. Your grandmother gave me that lamp, and now I'll never be able to get a new one. I really don't want to have to do this, but you're grounded. Now get into the corner for two minutes. Oh, but Mom, I don't want to be grounded. Two minutes in the corner right now, Billy. Twelve seconds later. Man, this really stinks. There has to be a way I can get out of it. Oh, I know. Mom, Mom, I'm really sorry. I'll never play ball in the house again. Can I stop being punished now? Oh, okay, sweetie. I think you learned your lesson. Your punishment is over. Come on out. <laughs> Mom's such a sucker. <laughs> You're going to jail, boy. Damn, bro, where was you at yesterday? Man, I overslept. I thought I might as well just stay home. Man, you missed everything. Ruby Rose was throwing it back on everybody in first period. What? Say you swear. Bruh, I swear. Oh, and Tupac and Biggie squashed the beef. They came back to life and performed in the cafeteria. Nah, gee, tripping. Bruh, ain't no way. They had Michael Jackson in there moonwalking on the lunch tables too. Damn, bro, did any of y'all get a video? Nah, bro, they said we couldn't use our phones. Nah. Damn, bro, the one day I don't show up. I'm saying, bro, and Mr. Beast put up to our classroom, gave everybody in the class 10 bands. What? Hey, let me hold 100, bro. Nah, you straight, jit. Should've came to school, that's your fault. Nah, I'm never missing a day again. I missed everything, that's crazy. I'm gonna call CPS on you someday. I bet you are, honey. I'm a terrible parent. Why? Because sending me to school should be a capital crime. Honey, how else are you going to learn to be a productive member of society? You're right. That would require someone to pay attention to me and to teach me morals. Okay, I just, I would just... Jeez, it's the school again? <sighs> oh. I didn't do anything this time. Hi, hi, hi. How are you? Is this Miss McKay? Yes, yes it is. Is Did she do something again? I, I'm sorry. I, I... No, ma'am. This is actually about you. Me? I didn't call CPS yet. As you know, this week was career day for the kids. Oh, yeah. She did tell me about that. I'm sorry I couldn't make it. It's a... Well, well, well career day is for those with careers. No, yeah. I, I, do, I do have a job. Well, with your job, it's probably best you stayed home away from the kids. I'm confused. You have a good job. I told everybody about your job. No, she she just said she told everybody what my job was. Oh, she did. She screamed from the top of the staircase that my mom is a prostitute. What? Give, give me two seconds, please. What? What? I just... Okay, I, I see the misunderstanding. I'm not a prostitute. I'm a prosecutor. <laughs> Uh, oh my god, ma'am, I, I'm so sorry. I'm, I apologize for the misunderstanding. H have a great day, all right. all right? Have a good day. What's the difference? Nice. I'm disappointed in you, mother. You and my own parents, why? <sighs> because you never achieved greatness like me. Honey, what, what greatness have you achieved during kindergarten? I don't know if you watch the news, but I'm the new president of the United States. You're the president now? Yep, me and my stuffed animals had a jury meeting in duty and they all voted for me to be the president. So now you have to do everything I say forever. The president is only in office for four years, so after that, what do I do? You're going to be lucky if you make it that long. I'm going to beat her ass. 
Dude, they, you can't touch me. I got the secret service behind me. They, they, but they are imaginary and secret, so you can't see them because they're secret. All right, sweetie. Now that you're president, what are you gonna what are you gonna do now? I'm gonna make weed legal. What? Everyone should weed. Read.